want to tell you guys something. I love nostalgia. I love feeling nostalgic. It just gives me the feeling of being a kid again. And then realizing I'm 21 and I'm in college. But besides the point, today we're continuing on the Spy Fox trilogy. Somewhere in the Alps. I got something very important out of a smelly trash can. Well, of course it's smelly. If you got it out of a trash can, you need a hobby. No, not smelly. Smelly. Wait, I'm in a society of meaningless evil poop. larceny lying and yelling. Oh. In her head. oh, that's cool. Kind of wish we had one of those. Oh, Spy Fox is going to fight those pigs? Or not. Dodges them. Spy Fox 2, some assembly required. Here we go. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. At least that music's back. That looks like the same plane that he took in the last game. It has a mailing label that reads to LaRoche, care of Chateau LaRoche, World's Fair. Wow, you can learn a lot by reading. That is true. Excuse me, sir. What seems to be the problem? Well, I hate to be the bearer of bad tidings, but unfortunately, I cannot allow you to enter through the service entrance. Why? I'm sorry, but I can only let waitresses. Let's get our photo taken. None. Arena. Fr Dentist. Wait, there's only three options. None. <laughs> no, 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 no. Wait. Arena. Arena. France. France. Dentist. Dentist. Hmm. Which one looks less suspicious? France. France. Let's let's go with France. Start the photo here. No. Jockey. No. Helicopter. No. Band leap. No. Waitress. Yes. Yeah, you know, let's just go with Nancy. Whatever. Here you are, sir. One waitress ID card. Oh my! I'm so happy that you were able to find it. I'll just like, keep your ID voice on file for you, than Nancy. Spy Foxes keep up right the now. good work. Oh, it's Napoleon. So Spycore has sent the famous Spy Fox to try and stop my plans for world domination. I will explain my entire plan to you in nauseating detail. Yes, monologue you see, for me. I reversed the scale on the smelly evil dog bot assembly instructions. I created a 1000 to 1 scale fully functioning evil dog bot. Of course, you've disguised the evil dog bot as the centerpiece for the World's Fair. People buying tickets for the World's Fair do not realize that as they file through the turnstile, they are unwittingly winding the highly this advanced clockwork mechanism too than within the evil Fox. dog bot. When the one millionth person has filed through, the dog bot, now wound to maximum capacity, will embark upon its horrifying rampage of destruction! No. Looks like it's a bus. Yes, I have removed the off switch and hidden it somewhere in the world's fair. So well, thanks cleverly. for telling us. Even if you did find the off switch, you would still need the activation code to turn the switch off. And even if you had the off switch and the activation code, you could never hope to get past the diabolically clever security device located in the evil dog bot's Achilles heel. There's the button right there, guys. I already found it. Instead of the beauteous red rose I ordered, I've been sent a mutant Venus flytrap by Napoleon LaRoche. This candied apple looks good. Watch what you're doing! You wanna <laughs> give me a coronary? Ah, Lenny! This leaf contains the information that you need. Throw me in the dumpster. Suit yourself. Oh! That's what you wanted. Or see what this does. I can see a square, a star, and a triangle. Square, star, triangle. Mm, I did it! <laughs> okay. Spy Fox got moves. <laughs> Let's get the rose. Madame, would this rose be suitable? Oh, thank you, sir. I'll just replace that atrocious flytrap with his beauteous rose. I can dispose of that flytrap for you. Obviously, you're a fox with home training. Yes, I am housebroken, thank you. <laughs> Melly oh, is up dude. to their usual bag of dirty tricks, I see. So, you picked up a microfish message from Dotty Dash. That's right, but all I could make out was something regarding an off switch activation code before the signal went dead. The signal was traced to an exhibit in a fair called WeWorld. Oh, we get to play him a little bit. Cool. 
I've been told that it's impolite to stare. He sounds like but Nicolas in this Cage. Case, ex- There's Donnie Dash. Walter, I'm glad you found me. That I've been on surveillance so here in WeWorld, searching the airwaves for anything suspicious. I intercepted a smelly message that has to do with some activation code. Please stand by. I'm going to transmit the activation code Dottie intercepted to you via the spy watch. Stay tuned. Cherry, pineapple, orange. I've got it, Walt. All right, let's try this. Let's see, what do we have to eat? I can see that goon breathing into the analyzer. It looks like pineapple right side up kick. Oh yeah, I remember this. All right, so we're gonna put this heat spray on this thermometer. <laughs> Let's take that. Let's see if she knows anything. Can you prepare pineapple right side up cake? Why, I won the French cooking medal of honor for my pineapple right side up cake, but I only have one pineapple right now. I have this Clone pineapple. This for me. Don't, don't touch that. Isn't that amazing? Thank you. All right, we got the two pineapples. Here you are, two big juicy pineapples. Yeah, look at them. They look pretty Wonderful. juicy, right? She just uses packages. <laughs> so she doesn't know how to make it. The secret to gourmet is hilarious. Careful. Oh, thank you. Let's breathe on it. Hmm. The this opening and closing work. of that door must be controlled by some sort of fingerprint recognition device. I wonder what would happen if... Don't try it. Really, Spy Fox? A picture of LaRoche. Hmm. So we need his fingerprints. Let's take those goggles. I wonder if I can get that welder to stay at the conveyor belt longer so I can get those goggles. Here, dude, we got your goggles. I believe back. these are yours, Cape Cod. Now, I'm gonna take these goggles. Can I borrow your dark goggles, Cape Cod? Heck, son, you can have them. I don't need them anymore. The light is bright, but this spy is brighter. Definitely. Oh, BRB, man. Let's release these flies. Perfect. All right. Here you are. It so happens I carry a fork for just this kind of situation. A fork? I've been looking all over for one. I learned in boot camp it pays to have a fork at all times. Thank you. <laughs> Boot camp. Because the food is. It's only a matter of time now before I have La Roche's prints. Oh, we're gonna get his prints. If he wears gloves. Pretty soon that boot is going to be inside of you. Doesn't make any sense. How does that make any sense? Oh, he got his fingerprint. Nothing to lose now. I got no idea how you got his fingerprint if he's wearing gloves. But like the old maybe the song gloves says, are part of a spoon for It's oh. the off code for the evil dog bot. Cherry pineapple orange. Cherry pineapple orange. It's the off code. There you go. That must be the on switch for the evil dog bot. Oh, right. Now it's time to destroy this thing. Around the roach's plan. That dog bot is now fully operational. Let's hit it. I don't think this is a good sign. Now it's bad off. dog bot. Sit. What? Perfect. Spy-bot! Sorry, Napoleon. You called? LaRoche, your evil days are over! <laughs> How's that thing even carrying him? Let's go. That spy box thinks he's so smart. I have one more trick to play before I make my escape through these sewer pipes. 
This computer program will set up a million toasters hidden in the dog box. Together, the toasters will simultaneously burn a million pieces of toast, leaving a dark gray cloud hanging over the fair for the next 10 months. Oh, there is a bug in the program, Axels. That dastardly LaRoche won't get away with that. Exactly. Not with Spy, Spy Fox. Fox on his trail. Get this hammer. This ball peen hammer looks interesting. It might come in handy. To spy jail to fluid. Oh. Perfect. <laughs> Why so late? I mean, then again, we don't want a little roach to hear. So that makes sense. Let's loosen the pipe. I want to pull the lever. It's down the drain for you, LaRoche! What? You again? See you later, LaRoche. You're going to jail. How humiliating. I didn't mess up this time. I know that for a fact. Wow. Don't be a baby.